Welcome to I Got You Day, your daily reflection and meditation. I'm Father Sony Sebastian, a Divine Word Missionary Priest. Today's Gospel serves as a lovely prelude to the Passion of Jesus. Jesus is back in the house of his friends, Mary, Martha and Lazarus, whom, who is recently brought back from the dead. As always, Martha, the active hostess, and Mary, the contemplative, brings a jar of expensive perfumed ointment and pours it all over the feet of Jesus, filling the house with its fragrance. It's a sign of great love. Though his own disciples and the other people present interpret this action with a lot of question, Jesus sees an altogether different meaning. He sees the tremendous love behind the action and interprets it as a symbolic anointing for his burial. Dying as a common criminal, Jesus would not have been normally anointed. You always have the poor with you, but you do not always have me. This is not to be understood in any cynical way. The poor cannot be truly loved except in God and in Jesus. Only those who truly love God are able to truly love the poor and all those in need. We are also told that Lazarus' own life is in danger as well as the life of Jesus. Lazarus is seen as a living sign of Jesus' divine power and so they both must be wiped out. Many of the church's martyrs died for the same reason. The word martyr means witness, witnessing to the truth, love and power of Christ. The question is, am I willing to be a martyr, a witness for Christ, to stand beside him on the cross as he is mocked and insulted? This is the week. This is the week for me to stand and answer to that question. So let's pray. Lord, help me. Help me to be a true witness to your life, death and resurrection.